Greetings and salutations, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to yet another Requiem tutorial with your host, Radiant Goat. Today's request is brought to us by Heath Patrick Dawson. Heath Patrick Dawson says, I am trying to create portholes to my concert worlds. How do I go about getting them to work and edit the name on the top of the doors? Well, there is many different ways to skin that cat, depending upon if you go CV1, CV2, there's all kinds of... Anyways, we will go through one particular procedure that will allow you to understand how to do a simple way for connecting doors to subrooms, and maybe this will get to your answer, okay? All right, let's get to it. All right, Heath, here we are. Let's just say that we are in our first room right now that we are trying to have a portal go to a second room. Very simple. It could be any room that you're in and it could be any room that you're going to. What we're obviously going to need is a door, right? Okay, I'm pretty sure you know how to get to this part. So you're searching in your palette, right? To go for the doors, you type in room door here, you'll end up seeing this. You click that, boink, there's a room door. Um, this is, I believe, the CV2 room door. It really doesn't matter because it, both CV1 and CV2, you can use the method that I am about to show you. So, you hit the configure tab. Configure. You point at the door, you click the door. You look at the configurations. Okay, it's locomotion, blah, blah, blah. Room door, link to room. Okay, now you need to enter the room. I happen to have another room on hand that I have already built that we will enter into here just for example purposes, okay? It is called Camp Honeycomb. C-A-M-P-H-O-N-E-Y-C-O-M-B. Camp Honeycomb, okay? Hit X, see us in there. Camp Honeycomb is right there. Link to room, Camp Honeycomb. Click the X. Success! Linked to Camp Honeycomb. Camp Honeycomb, there it is. So, now if I go into the Camp Honeycomb, right? Do you want to save? Well, I really don't want to save because this will be the end of this tutorial, so let's not save and we're just going to go travel. Right. It looks like you're the first one here. And as you can see, we have now entered Camp Honeycomb, right? If you like, this is you Camp Honeycomb. And there also is another door that I have created that goes to a place called Portal Chamber. Well, let's see if where this goes. And here is Portal Chamber. Now, I know it doesn't look like a lot right now, but there's a bit more going on here than it appears. So, yeah. Anyways, uh, this is a way, basically, that you can uh, make doors that are invisible. See? But uh, you have to be putting one of the right blocks, color blocks on there to go to the correct and stand in there, and then it teleports you to the correct... It's a little more complicated, but this is a different way of doing the same thing that you're trying to do, um, just with hidden doors. See, they disappear, but it still works. Anyways, that is a different tutorial. I hope this answered your question, Heath. Have a great day. Goodbye. Your call cannot be taken at the moment, so please leave your message after the tone. <laughs> 